Good Monday, everybody. I'm student meteorologist Stephen Puglisi here with a look at the forecast for February 11th, 2019. It's cloudy out there to begin your week, and unfortunately, uh, this will not only remain in place today, so we will be dealing with cloudy skies and cold temperatures today, but we actually have a very significant uh, winter storm on the way for tomorrow, which we will certainly be getting into in quite a bit of detail in just a moment. By the middle of the week, though, Wednesday, Thursday, we should be dry and milder as well, but Friday looks like a complete mess. So winter weather advisory up for the entire state of Connecticut. This is in effect from 6 tomorrow morning until 6 o'clock on Wednesday. So a good 24-hour long storm, a pretty long duration event with some pretty substantial impacts as well. Nothing uh, too terrible out there right now, though, in Danbury. As of 11 o'clock, we had a temperature of 30 degrees with a dew point of 14. That's a 51% humidity with wind out of the north at 6 miles per hour. Now, the temperature for today of 30 right here, it's really not going to get much warmer than that. So definitely uh, bundle up. It's not going to be a uh, very warm day by any stretch. Tomorrow, though, looks substantially worse. Here's our national surface map for tomorrow. Now, if there is ordinarily a low offshore here, we'd be talking about a very big snowstorm. The problem is that there's another low pressure system here over the Great Lakes. Those two kind of will interact with one another. The one offshore will be a little bit stronger, and that will cause uh, basically a big time wintry mix. Uh, for your day tomorrow. A storm that, uh, in a bit of a rare circumstance here, looks to be mostly sleet, in fact. So, uh, on our visible satellite, I mean, let's not kid ourselves, it's not going to do uh, any clearing at all today. It's cloudy and it will be that way for uh, today and tomorrow and, frankly, part of, if not most, of Wednesday as well. On our radar, here is our storm system for tomorrow. This will gradually be pushing off to the north. It'll take another uh, 24 hours or so to get here, uh, maybe a little bit less. But uh, when it does, it'll arrive in the form of snow, and we should get at least a little bit of accumulation before that changeover. So tomorrow, we're going from snow to sleet to freezing rain, possibly in the overnight hours of Tuesday night into Wednesday. We're going with one to three inches of snow. That happens during the middle of the day tomorrow, and then we change over to sleet, and it sleets for probably almost 12 hours, uh, and it sleets hard, but sleet doesn't really accumulate that well, so we're looking at perhaps one to two inches of sleet, which is actually very significant accumulation of sleet. You don't get that very often. And then uh, a light glaze possible by Wednesday morning, depending on when that change over to freezing rain happens and assuming the temperatures at the surface are just a little bit under 32, which is currently what I am expecting. So let's time this out a little bit as I go over here to Gillier out of the way. Here we are. This is Tuesday morning tomorrow at 10 o'clock. The snow just on the doorstep of Danbury here. And as we push this uh, along a little bit here, this is 3 o'clock. And there's that mix line. It's just reached uh, our area and just off to the north. It's still snow in Litchfield County. But here it's changed over to sleet and it sleets and sleets and sleets. By 6 in the morning, all of this finally comes to an end with perhaps some freezing rain because the temperatures here uh, where you see this will likely still be below freezing. But the bottom line is the roads will still be uh, quite a mess on Wednesday morning. What does this mean for schools and classes here at Westcon? Well, I think that most classes tomorrow will be canceled. In fact, it is definitely possible that all day long the school is outright closed tomorrow. And frankly, if you have classes on Wednesday morning, I can't tell you for sure that they'll be on either as the cleanup begins from this storm. So let's go to our extended forecast now. Uh, winter, that major winter storm tomorrow, we clear things out at least to a point by Wednesday. We'll have decreasing clouds through the day. We'll finally see some sun in the afternoon with a high of 39. Thursday will be mild with partly cloudy skies and a uh, pretty nice day out there then. Friday, however, looks messy with heavy rain and wind, likely. And then Saturday, we have to watch as an area of low pressure tries to form just off the coast and give us some more mixed precipitation. So Saturday doesn't look great, but that certainly can still change, and we'll keep you posted as that moves on. The big story this week certainly remains that winter storm for Tuesday and Wednesday. So thank you so much for watching. I'm student meteorologist Stephen Puglisi. Be sure to follow us across the social media platforms. Have a great day and stay safe tomorrow.